Good morning. Welcome back to Breakfast Television. 825 smiles just got bigger in studio about 15 <laughs> minutes ago like when that. Fred Penner walked through the door. You have that effect on people. <laughs> I wonder why. I wonder why indeed. Um, big show tomorrow night at the West End Cultural tomorrow Center. Tomorrow afternoon, yeah. Tomorrow two afternoon of them. and tomorrow night. Yeah. That's right. We'll talk about that first. Okay. So let's talk. That's to wrap up the year. Let's talk about the year 2012. You had it's a been really a good year. Yeah. yeah, lots, lots of travel, uh, lots of festivals doing the. Uh, the folk festivals during the summer, uh, a lot of university gigs, playing the pub nights <laughs> from coast to coast, and the uh, and the cat came back right around the corner at the YPT Theater or at the MC YP, and we're taking it to Toronto to the YPT Theater in uh, in March this year. What's so it like for not. you? This is a song you've been singing for decades, forever, <laughs> forever indeed. and ever. What was it like to see that come alive oh, on the it stage? Is. <laughs> I, it was great. It, it, it's it's not just the the verses of the song come to life. It's a whole story about the relationship with Mr. Johnson. Old Mr. Johnson had troubles of his own, and Jay Brazzo, as you can see on the screen, uh, plays uh, plays Mr. Johnson. This character is being tormented by the cat. That cat is amazing. <laughs> he, he really is. And Paul Hoosen is uh, operating the cat along with Jesse Havey, who you probably know from the, from the Ducks That's and right. lots of musical parts of this world. But uh, uh, it, it was a great experience. We had a, had a blast doing it. We took it to Calgary as well, and I'm really excited that we're going to do it in, uh, in Toronto. Very exciting. Bingo. So more big things Onward to come. Onward and upward. Exactly. Yeah. Now, you mentioned you've been doing these pub shows uh, for university crowds. Yeah. Uh, we kind of we missed you, I guess, for once your show wrapped up, there was a bit of a lull, and, uh, and then you came back and started doing these shows, speaking to the audience that grew up with you. It, what what yeah. made you realize that that was something you should uh, kind of it was into? It was email, you know, the, the good old social media world. Uh, kids were kids. Young people were sending me messages saying, "I, I grew up with you. I'm, I'm going into education because of you. I play guitar because of you." All these contacts, and these were from late teen, early twenties kids. And then I started thinking, "Well, these people are going to university now. Maybe I, you know they're, they're not necessarily going to come to my concert, so I need to go to them." <laughs> it, uh, it was it was one of those epiphanies of life, you know. Definitely. And now, afternoon show tomorrow at the West End Cultural Center. 2 p.m., yeah. And then another one in the evening for the big kids. <laughs> Is there a difference in the show aside from the keg tap? <laughs> a, li a little bit. Just just a little bit. The uh, uh, the cat came back will be there. Sandwiches will be there. I open the, uh, open the floor to the audience if they have particular requests they want to hear. I, I bring in some of the tunes from my, uh, from my background, some Cat Stevens, uh, uh, songs that I've written that wouldn't necessarily fit in a family, n not uh, loosely called adult oriented, but they're, uh, yeah, it's going to be a great evening. Definitely. Do and you full band, is f and full band as well. Okay, so yeah. many times we're used to you and the guitar, so you'll have a full production Bass, bass drums, you. children doing the backup singing, it's, uh, it's going to be great. Very nice. Is it different for you, the energy, when you're playing for kids as opposed to when you're playing for the adult crowd? Only slightly. Uh, n n not really, be because the, uh, I, I try and bring the same kind of energy to w when any performance you do. You're only as good as your last gig, right? Okay. <laughs> and, uh, and so when I'm on stage, it's, it's, it's interacting. It's come on, be part of this, it's participate. What do you want to hear? It's that energy that I, that I try not to uh, you know, vary in my life. That's right. And whether you're 8 or 28, you're singing along to all the songs. Bingo. So that makes the room that much more exciting. We're going to hear a sneak peek from Fred. You're sticking around to play us a song? I am. All right. Let's take a look now at your morning news with Courtney Ketchum. Good morning, 845. You're watching Breakfast Television. Thanks so much for joining us this morning. Fred Penner knows he can't stop by the studio without playing us a song. One of my most favorite things about this season is that there's a lot of really great individual, local, original holiday songs out there. And Fred's going to play one of his, his show tomorrow afternoon and tomorrow night at the West End Cultural Center. This is Saskatoon Berry Pie. Exactly. All this talk about food scene is lacking my... My mouth is drooling, and one of my favorite foods, as Janice said, is Saskatoon Berry Pie. And I hope that many of you are drooling along with me. Make me a pie to start the day. Only you can make it in your special way. Crust so flaky it can make me cry. Great Grandma Saskatoon Berry Pie. Great Grandma Saskatoon Berry Pie. Make me a pie after dinner. Pie's the best, your pie's a winner. Mm -mm -mm, my oh my, great 
grandma Saskatoon berry pie. Great grandma Saskatoon berry pie. There's nothing in the world that tastes so good. I always give it 10 out of 10. I can smell it bacon in the neighborhood. Grandma, won't you tell me when I can visit? Anytime, anytime, when the time is right. I'll do the dishes after a snack. I have got a healthy appetite. I always keep coming back cause I love you, cause I love you. Yeah, make me a pie to start the day. Only you can make it in your special way. Crust so flaky it can make me cry. Great grandma Saskatoon berry pie. 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 Not pumpkin or apple or raisin or peach. Saskatoon berry pie.